So the word forever gird or gird has been trending and um, apparently a, an FC Bayern footballer Robert Lewandowski I'm not sure if that's how the name is pronounced was putting it on so that's the reason why this word forever gird or gird is trending. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel where I teach us to make money on life fast and easy. In today's video, we're going to continue with the 33rd episode of Top 5 Pronounce Money Research of the Week. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Before we get right into it, I don't know if you can notice from my voice that um, it's a little bit shaky. And that's because uh, I wasn't feeling too well. I took the vaccine yesterday and... Um, it's been giving me a little bit of fever and headache and body aches and all the like. So let me know down in the comment section below if you have taken the vaccine. If yes, which of the vaccines did you take? Was it Pfizer or the others? And uh, did you have any side effects? I would like to know in the comment section below so we can get discussing. Now, at the end of this video, we're going to release the name of the person who won our last week's giveaway. So if you'd like to know who won, stick around to the end. So with that out of the way, let's talk about the top five niches of the week. So I will start with this one right here that says forever girl or jerk. I'm not sure how that is pronounced. So I noticed that this was trending all over flying research. It was popping out in the bestsellers and things like that. Look at this. 340 sales and just one review and you guys know that whenever I um, I've always said this before that whenever you see a t-shirt with so many sales but only a review that means that the shirt was a hot selling t-shirt and it didn't have the time to um, leave people haven't had time to leave reviews so that's a good indicator that the shirt is trending and um, if you scroll down and um, this trail is priced $13.99 over 340 sales one review and uh, I was wondering what the meaning of uh, forever jerk is or gird I'm not sure how that is pronounced so I did some search online and um, what does it mean so when I I searched in the images and this one popped up and um, it looks like so guys, it's all related to football. A footballer put on this, or was putting on the word forever gird or jerk, and that's why it's um trending. So the first thing that I did was to search if this word was trademarked because if it's trademarked, there's just no way we can make designs with it because it will be. The design will be taken down. So I went to find research, went to trademark search, I searched for forever gird or forever jerk, and I didn't see any results. That means that the niche is safe to make designs for. And uh, that was a niche number one. Niche number two is this Beagle Dad. So you guys know that um, I'm always a sucker for making designs that I can scale and this is just one of them so Beagle Dad you can obviously change that to Beagle Mom Beagle Uncle, Beagle Auntie, Beagle if you can even move to professions it's just not for family relationships you can say uh, Beagle Policeman, Beagle Firefighter so that's how you can easily create hundreds and hundreds of designs from just one template and that is what I'm doing right now because I'm in tier 1000 and I'm trying to get teared up as fast as possible. I already have the sales. I already have um, above 2000 sales. That means all that is left for me to do is to get my slots filled up. And that's what I'm trying to do. So designs like this, they strike a... Uh, it's kind of attractive to me because I would like to scale my designs. And these are the best designs that I can scale and get more designs to upload to mesh by amazon so with that being said this design right here is um price 16.99 it's in the french marketplace and price 21 
um sorry 21 sales and price 16.99 pounds and it hasn't had a review yet and um you can even change this beagle to other types of animals it must not just be a beagle it can also be a, maybe a woodpecker it can also be uh, a a cat it can also be a bird so different types of birds and you can also uh, you can use different types of dogs for example if you're not just using a beagle you can also go for a dalmatian dog you can also go for a pug pug dad so that's how you can scale this niche um to hundreds and thousands of designs so guys if, if you're finding value from this don't forget to hit the, the like button and also subscribe for more videos so that was niche number two niche number three is another design that you can scale so this one says just a girl who loves elephants uh, it's price 16.99 over eight sales and no reviews yet and um, the reason why i chose this design is because first of all before before i go into the reason why i chose it is in the italian marketplace and um, the reason why i chose it is because you can change these elephants to other types of animals you can say just a girl who loves lions just a girl who loves dogs just a girl who loves cats just a girl who loves giraffes just like that you can um, get hundreds and hundreds of designs and you can also change it from a girl to a boy just a boy who loves elephants just a boy who loves giraffe just a boy who loves birds you can also change the boy to dad just a dad who loves just like that so you guys get the issues that's how i would go about um getting more and more designs to upload to all my print on demand platforms with ease so and uh, when i go to upload it all i'll be changing is from elephants i will change it uh, to a dog i mean in my description there's just a kind of tiny changes that i make and uh, i have hundreds of design up in no time because right now i have 40 designs per day and i try to maximize and fill it up before um, the day runs out so with this strategy i'm able to create hundreds of designs with ease so it's the same strategy that you guys should be using it's the same strategy that, strategy that you guys should be using so that was it for niche number three and just, so that was it for niche number three niche number four is this um school kind it's actually in the German marketplace and let's just do a quick search for school kind <laughs> I'm not so I'm not sure how that is pronounced let's go to Google Translate and um, I think it's related to school that's why I chose this there you go so school child school child you know um, now is a back to school season and uh, school child 2021 so this is obviously in the german marketplace and you guys can tell right here trend is up trend is up so back to school season right now is back to school season and um, kids are going back to school and um, in-person learning for that matter and parents are getting all back to school supplies including coatings and things like that so this shirt is one of them and um, school child 2021 and next year it will be school child 2022 school child 2023 so things like that that's how we can um, scale the design every year um, but for this year this is what is trending school child 2021 um you guys say school girl 2021 school boy 2021 um, so that's how i go about scaling this design and as you can tell overall trends of current trends up so from the same brand here are the different designs and we're moving over to the last niche of today which is this design limited edition with a year so guys you guys know that i've been talking about designs that you can scale like this especially these limited edition designs so there are different versions of this limited edition and this is just one of them that is doing quite well and the reason why i chose this particular design is because it's different why is it different its design is vertical so the other ones you know the designs are like this they're horizontal but 
this design is vertical so this makes this design stand out from the rest and not only is it vertical it's also grunge so um, if if you were a customer for example and you see different designs that look like this all of them vertical all of them vertical then you come across a design that looks like this horizontal wouldn't you be more drawn to it because I know I'll be drawn to it so this is the reason why uh, I chose this design to show you a different method that you can create a design if everybody is making designs like this horizontal you should be creating designs that are like this vertical so that's what I wanted to bring to you guys attention and it's doing quite well price 19.99 pounds and euros sorry and um, it's already had 63 sales nine reviews and uh, in the edition like it can be for birthdays as well as anniversary so that's the reason why I like such shirts or design so we can scale this one 2003 to 2004 okay we start from 1990 or 1960s becomes i usually start from 1960s um then i start scaling 1960s 1961 1962 just like that we'll obviously reach 2003 then we can take take it from there 2003 2004 2005 and things like that up to 2021 so those are hundreds of designs that you can just include and change only the year in your in your your title and you're good to go so Talking about this overall trend is up as you can see the BSR it has almost flatlined as you can see here but it's um, almost approaching one keyword you can use obviously it's in the German marketplace but we can tell what these words are talking about we, we can recognize this one limited edition and um, actually that's the only one I recognize but we can tell the keywords that we can use we can use limited edition year 2003 um, birthday as well as anniversaries design shirt funny you know stuff like that grunge yeah those are keywords that I can use and from the same brand this one right here and uh, it's pretty pretty dark if I were the one I wouldn't have chosen this dark shirt if I had a dark design like this I would have chosen something gray you know gray gray works with black uh, as well as white so uh, if I were one I wouldn't enable it for this for this sh I wouldn't enable the design for this color because um, it's pretty pretty dark both designs are dark but not regardless people are, it has still sold so that works so guys I'm moving over to the second part of this video which is revealing the name of the person who won so as usual I'm gonna go to our last week's video and grab the link go back here and paste get YouTube comments and start Marlene Marlene congrats to you thank you for your comment you said love these research videos so valuable just found out about your giveaway so excited I'm excited about you because you just won a present giveaway so congrats to you and um, if you want to contact me to claim your giveaway actually what you've just won is 30 minutes one-on-one -on -one call with me to ask any questions that you want personal questions to, that you want to ask me um my time is all for you 30 minutes so that's what you want and if you want to contact me right here on my channel you can grab my email address and give me a call and i'll be at your service so guys if you found anything helpful in this video please give it a thumbs up if you'd like to learn more about print on demand KDP, there's a channel for you. Hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification so you'll be the first notified when I release a new video. With that being said, see you on the next one.